Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to add a second NIC to your Proxmox installation. Now, let's say you have a an old desktop that you're running Proxmox on and you only have one ethernet jack and you're like, I need more static IPs or you need another ethernet jack, you know, another reason to put it on a separate VLAN. 15 bucks, get an USB to ethernet adapter if your computer can't get a PCI Express and then you add it that way, but you can get a USB to ethernet and then plug that in, reboot the machine, make sure it's plugged in. And now let's go to our Proxmox installation. As you can see, we're in our Proxmox server. We wanna go ahead and click on our server here, PVE1. And then you can see when we reboot our device, it's gonna come up with this random serialized uh, ENX. That's that USB to ethernet adapter. And then if you wanna get this mounted onto an actual VM, you need to create a Linux bridge. So you hit create Linux bridge. You put in that bridge port uh, name, which is that long set of numbers there, which I already did that. As you can see right here, this is my bridge that I created. If we hit edit, you don't need to set a static IP here. If you want to add a second IP to your Proxmox to get to this web interface, then you can actually put an IP address here and then you can actually get to it from this IP and the other IP you have set for your other. So like I said, once you do this, you put in that bridge port, you hit okay. If we go into a VM, go to hardware. And if you go into your VM and then you see your network device, you can see we set it for a VM BR1. If we hit edit, you can just verify that's what it's set for. Now, if we go into that VM, go to console here. Now I didn't set a static IP for this VM because it's just set for DHCP right now, but you can see we are connected to that network and we are getting a DHCP address and we can get out to the internet. So there you go. Well, that's it, you guys. I hope this video was helpful and this is how you can add a second NIC to your Proxmox installation. See you guys in the next video. Thank you.